Let's sort this array together with the selection sort. This has the time complexity of big O of n squared and sorts the array in place using only constant extra space. Initialize p1 to be 0, the first index of the array. This keeps track of where the next smallest element should go. And set p2 equal to p1. This is responsible for finding the next smallest element. Loop p2 from p1 to the end of the array to find the index of the minimum element in that range. That is 0 at index 8 in this case. Swap the element at p1 with the min element found by p2. Then increment p1 to move the sorted boundary forward. Now repeat, set p2 equal to p1. Loop p2 from p1 to the end of the array to find the index of the minimum element in that range. That is 1 at index 6 now. Swap the element at p1 with the min element found by p2 and increment p1. Keep repeating this process. Note that sometimes the minimum element is already at p1, so the swap won't move anything, such as in this case here. Keep repeating until p1 reaches the second to last index of the array. After that iteration, the list is sorted.